Good morning, you guys. It is uh, May May 10th, Wednesday, May 10th. I got my bag, got my backpack. I'm headed out to Japan today. <sighs> so, sorry, it seems like the camera is a little foggy. I'm heading out to Japan today um, with Remio. Our flight's at 1 a.m. this morning, so tonight. So we gotta be at the airport at like 11 p.m. tonight, Wednesday night. Today she might be a short vlog or quick. I'm gonna upload it early too because I'm going to try to get it uploaded before I leave for Japan. Um, and we leave at like 10 because I gotta be at the airport at 11, whatever. So it'll be up way before 10. I'm gonna stop filming before then because I'm gonna be um, vlogging my airport trip to Japan separately. We'll make a separate vlog of me doing that because um, K-Town Collective sponsored me on some edibles and they gave me um, a couple good edible bars to keep me medicated for my trip over to Japan. And so I'm gonna document how that goes and see how funny it is if I pass out. One of the bars, it's their strongest bar, is uh, 100 milligrams, and it's supposed to knock you out. And uh, they gave me a second one called a what the fuck bar, and it has 1600 milligrams. So we're gonna see how that goes. Should be pretty funny, honestly. I can handle weed, but 1600 milligrams seems like a lot. I'm about to go pick up Frankie Fresh right now. Trying to get him a new job over at RVM, step up his game. RVM is a uh, barbershop over on Wilshire. We got Morris, my boy Morris, a job over there. He's making that real paper, making executive moves. Um, so we're trying to get Frankie set up over there too, so that should be pretty dope. I'm about to go pick his ass up um, And then head in it is Wednesday, so Ernesto's in we're gonna have a meeting with my man Anthony about some uh, marketing techniques that we can use for Instagram because he uses Instagram marketing and he says it's Really the move the wave so I'm gonna try to get on that Katie's in we tattooed her side yesterday I started a big ass panther, and the poor kid couldn't even, uh, she couldn't hack it. So we had to fucking stop halfway through. So it's, that's real though. Fucking side tattoos are absolutely no joke. Um, pretty much probably one of the painfulest, most painful spots to get tattooed is on your ribs. So shout out to Katie for even being able to do half of the tattoo, anyways. But I didn't want to put her on blast or make fun of her yesterday, so that's why we didn't get to see any part of the tattoo or whatever. Anyways, I'm gonna head into work, go grab my man Frankie Fresh, get everything ready for Japan, and uh, get the fuck out of here. Fuck, I forgot to shave. Son of a bitch. I guess I'm gonna be uh, stubbly and bearded by this whole trip. I guess I don't give a fuck. You know what? I super don't give a fuck. And uh, I have a beautiful girlfriend, Sarah, anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Shout out to her for giving me the duffel bag to use to be able to transport these Romeo sweaters. I was kind of stressing on that. And shout out to Francisco for helping us pack up everything for Japan and getting us ready because without all my help, um, I'd have a hard time doing what I do and traveling even or any of this shit. So shout out to my whole team for their constant support and help. You guys are the shit. Bags packed, ready to go? Yep. Oh man. We're going to Japan, dog. Uh, well, right now we're going to work, right? <laughs> <laughs> and 10 hours or 11 hours from now, I'll be en route to leaving for Japan. In like 24 hours. In 24 <laughs> hours, I'll be in Japan. Fuck, man. So you don't know much about Japan? I don't know nothing about Japan. I'm looking forward to seeing your pictures. Yeah, all right. Yeah. You never been to Asia? Never been to Asia in my life. Huh? 
That's cool. But you've been obviously to Europe. Been where Europe. where in Europe? I've been London. I've been Spain. And where in Spain? I've been to Madrid, I think it was. I like Madrid. I was there with my dad, my mom and my baby sister. That was quite a while ago. And <coughs> Been to Colombia. Oh, word. You've been to been Bogota? To, uh, no, I've been to Medellin. 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 My mom has family there. I didn't even know about that. Yeah. I didn't know about it until I went there. My mom showed me. Yeah. Yeah. It's a cool place. Really it's, nice. It's really nice. It's it's not exactly like the richest place to go. No, it's a lot of uh, favelas and shit. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a nice place though. Like the view, everything. But Japan though, I need to see your pictures bro I'm looking forward to hearing what it's like I yeah. want to know what it's like badly. badly yeah it'll be a cool experience I definitely have to travel there though the goop yeah oh, psh, easy have to bro yeah we'll go in a couple years that'll be tight that'll be fuming show me what you already know oh yeah. <coughs> that'll be, yeah that'll be fucking bro I've been going to Japan since 2011 so I got a bunch of good friends out there it's super cool what up Michael how are you brother it's like your second home bro mm, I wouldn't say that but <laughs> Amsterdam, maybe. Oh, Amsterdam. Amsterdam. I got the Amsterdam on the finger. You fuck with Amsterdam. Oh, yeah. Everyone yeah. fucks with Amsterdam, bro. That's What's, like the most... enjoy about Amsterdam? It's just a comfortable city. The people are cool. Food's cool. Weather is pretty decent. The Vondel Park is amazing. You been to Amsterdam? Nope. No. No, it's, re yeah. it's really... It's like an older city, you know? It's like how London and, and things like, hey, you, what you like about the UK, you'd like about Amsterdam because it's like, it's old, there's like a circle, it's like a circle, like a town square. It's really cool. Old so museums. It's like one of them old European cities. Like a Mario Kart. Exactly, city. they haven't updated I'm anything, so it's cobblestone <laughs> as fuck. You know, they got the tram that runs, you have to ride the tram to go anywhere. Yeah, that's booming, I'd definitely like to see that shit. No, it's fun, and then obviously the coffee shops are cool. They have a cool museum district, so it's like, they really like art. It's pretty cool. There's a thing called the Vondel Park. Vondel Park, what'd you do there? It's just like a park, but there's like animals and a lake and like a Ferris wheel kind of thing or whatever, a little, uh, not a Ferris wheel, what the fuck, merry-go-round. Cool. It's pretty fucking tight though. So, shout out to Amsterdam, shout out Holland, shout out to UK, shout out to Japan. We're worldwide. We're worldwide, baby. So Daniel had a... Get down on the death metal font. Making the million death metal <laughs> logo. Death metal dog. Dog metal. Yeah, it's fire. All packed up for Japan. Signature Katie Rose. Yeah. What are y'all talking about? The Mexican food right here, like, you know, I'm like a half a block down or whatever. I just had the most bomb Mexican food the other night. Oh, I wow. forgot all about it. It's the sleeper, it's the sleeper, not sleeper, slept on spot in Hollywood. What? El Compadre. Oh, dude, that's fucking funny. That's what, that's what inspired the whole yeah, conversation yeah. you saw the receipt. Yeah, yeah. fucking, I'm, we're, we want El Compadre right now. Dude, that's like the, the fight. Yeah. El Compadre. I fucking was there a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Which one, did you go to the most one? Or the no, right up the street. What do you think about, uh... I like the Hollywood one better. About... El compadre? Yeah. Is that chingon? It's super good. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I've been there. Uh, I've been to the one... Uh, is it on Echo Park? Or... There's there's three of them. Uh, yeah, yeah, I've been to that one. It's good. I love Mexican food. What can I say? It's a good one though, right? Yeah. That's fine. It's not really authentic though, huh? No, it's very hard to find real authentic Mexican food over here. But so, it's close. Close enough. I loved it. It's cool, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what do you get there? Uh, enchiladas. Yeah, I did too. Oh, yeah? I got yeah. the enchilada and the chili relleno. Oof. Yeah, my girl loves the chili relleno. Oh, God. So good. 
What do you get, Daniel? What's up? What do you get? What's your El Compadre fucking dream meal here? Oh, dude, you just fucking, you get the uh, fajitas, shrimp it, fajitas. Well, you get the three meat fajitas, the, the fajita trifecta is the way. Damn. <laughs> that sounds cracking. But yeah, you're right. That is the move. My chicken, my chick got a chicken quesadilla. Uh-huh. Fire. She got a quesadilla and I got the chili relleno enchilada combo plate. <laughs> and it was so much food that we left an entire another entree amount of food for, you know, that we didn't eat. Yeah, you always like gather up the leftovers and then it's breakfast. Yeah, and throw an egg on it the next morning. For sure. sure. That's the fucking move. Yeah, you never finish. Yeah. And the right. flame, flaming margarita. I get the steak. The, the steak. steak <laughs> the steak burrito and the chili relleno <laughs> combo. Cause it, and then the beans and rice. And then my girl gets the fajitas and then I'll take the tortillas because you could just eat I think we're just going to go back and get like a fajita trio thing and just that's it. Yeah, that's all I ever ordered is just the fajitas. Damn, dude. Maybe an ad. I need to go. But you can't do it. You don't even really need it because of the, the chips and salsa and if you get And the like, drinks and yeah. then that, everything. That's the app. That's all you need right there. Full blown app. Yeah. Maybe some guac, but often, I don't know if Compadre does it, but. They do guac. You get guac with the fajitas, so it's like you don't even need. Yeah, you get that little like salsa guac. Yeah, the cheese. uh, Yeah, the little Mexican flag of fucking Mm -hmm. condiments. Yeah, it's pretty fire. So, what kind of enchilada is your choice? I just have the cheese enchilada. That's fine. Because I I share with my girl, so she's vegetarian. So cheese enchilada works. Yeah, and it's amazing. Like you don't need for ten dollars. Yeah, like. Lots of fries, beans, yeah, agua de horchata, <laughs> michelada. Not the michelada. That's what your girl gets? She gets all fucked up? <laughs> no, she doesn't drink anymore. So, no, no micheladas for her. Oh, okay. That's good enough for me. Show up early. Katie. Oh, got some Daniel footage? Yes. For the next episode. The block. Oh. Yeah, it looks good. You're hooked. You're hooked. Um. <laughs> I'm not really. <laughs> not really. Just figuring it out. Semi hooked. Damn, wait, wait. get an iPad Pro. Are you liking it though? The yeah, iP- yeah. Yeah, it's fun. It's always cool to try and stuff. Fun. Yeah, it's easier, huh? Well, yeah. maybe not easier, but like. But Pancho told faster. me that he doesn't even know how yeah, to use a computer. Yeah, it's faster to like he could use that. Recognize <laughs> mistakes and then to like kind of judge things and then go back in, you know. Yeah. It's cool, right? The iPad. Yeah. Can you talk a little bit about your Japan trip? So me and Remyo are going to Japan. And we're going to do a uh, pop-up shop at a shop called Minano in Tokyo. Um, and we're going to sell a limited edition hoodie. We just pack them up. Uh, hopefully these don't get fucked up. Um, yeah, it'll be super cool. We're doing the drop on the 14th. And uh, just a limited release in Japan. So I'm getting everything ready to fly out tonight at 10 o'clock. And we'll be uh, in Japan for a week. Japan trip. Not the Japan trip. You excited? See some videos? Yeah. I'm gonna uh, vlog my trip over. I'm gonna get really high on an edible. <laughs> I'm gonna get like. Right before you. Yeah. Fly? And I'm gonna <laughs> like... make a vlog of the whole. Me flying there. I don't know how fun a vlog of me being in an airplane the whole time is going to be. <laughs> That's going to be fun. I have a feeling I that... I want to eat one of those bars, too. I'm so what did you read about the bar? It was like $80. And then it's <laughs> fucking... He got one bar and it was like the bougie fucking super nice fucking bar. But then there's like this death bar. Like, <laughs> fuck your whole day. Maybe the next day up, too. And it's ten pieces in one little section equals the more, whole nice More bar. than the other Yeah, bar. it's something wild and he's going to eat the whole fucking thing. I have to. Pass out. Who is Sean? Sean's going to eat the whole thing. The whole death one? Yeah. 
I think it has like a skull and crossbones on it or something like that. You wanna see what it looks like? Yeah. <laughs> so here's the regular one. Okay. Seems pretty normal, right? Yeah, that's just a regular one. It says 100 milligrams. <laughs> 1600. <laughs> so it would be eating 16 of these. So you're gonna eat it all at once? I'm gonna eat all this. Oh shit, oh. Okay. <laughs> and I'm gonna vlog it. Have you done that before? Yeah, of course. I mean, okay. not like, but not specifically, I've never had this. <laughs> I have a feeling this is gonna make me pass out. <laughs> I want to watch that vlog. Give me one of the chunks and I'll let you know. <laughs> Francisco, you're working. <laughs> I'll be <all> right. <laughs> May cause dizziness or drowsiness. Yeah, drowsiness is like definitely going to happen. That's not, that's without question. It says it's lab tested. Have you, 16 pieces. have you ever had any and edibles, kid? Yeah. What happened? I time to drive home. The first time I got high, down, like, know, ever, I think, I ate seven edibles, like, yeah. and just immediately, like, <laughs> you know what I mean? You're like, seven oh, edibles. Ow. Seven, yeah. Katie had seven edibles. Yeah. Of what, enchiladas? Other I want seven inch a lot of edibles right now. That would be so fire. Dude, dude. See what's up with post mating some fucking uh, El Compadre. Oh, I could do an inch a lot of fucking lunch. Or fucking uh, send the Kate, Kate Land. Oh, yeah, because we do need to go to uh, Blick and shit and fucking. Opposite direction. Yeah, it is. Dude. It's four minutes up the street. We do need to go to Blake, though. And you know where you catch the bus, Daniel? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. It's one more block farther. So. It's true. It's right up the street, bro. Fucking pinch it, Daniel. Pinch it, Daniel. Pinch it, Daniel. You should pinch Daniel, Katie. Pinchy Daniel. Wasn't there a spot on Melrose called PJ's Tacos? Or was it, what was it, what was it called? Frida's Tacos. Frida's yeah. is terrible. Yeah. Oh, God, no. Was it terrible? It's, yeah. It is terrible. Yeah, it's terrible. <laughs> Thank you, sir. It's, it's official, it's terrible. Terrible, Frida's is terrible. But yeah. I could go from, uh, for some El Compadre. Never had a bad experience. Well, let's party. You can't get a margarita if you Probably can. You can just slam it there. Not on fire. Or just It'll melt the styrofoam cup. Just make them here. Yeah, just hold the whole thing on fire. Just go get the fixings at CVS. Oh, yeah, for sure. You can do that. Great, Daniel. Get blender. Just have a margarita station and air station. Oh, that would be fire. Margarita the margarita station would be totally fire. Ironic. Yeah, that's exactly what I need a margarita before I do a tag. Quit pretending, quit reverse psychology, everybody, dog. We're not gonna do it. <laughs> yeah. You're like, yeah, just like put it in. I would never use it anyway, so. Chill. The, mar in. the margarita station. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Put what in? Jesus, you guys. Margarita station. I got a ball. I got a ball. You're just wilding out now, huh? Psycho. Psycho so crazy. So at Tokyo Hands, there's this crazy section in their like. <laughs> yeah, Francisco. 
Don't you dare. Sorry, thank you. I, I, yeah, it's, you'll see it. Yeah, Bonnie. Um, there's a section like their painting and decorating section, and it's got fan decks for like every kind of. What is this you're talking about? Tokyo hands. I don't know what that is. It's um, it's in Shibuya. Mm -hmm. Are you recording? Yeah, yeah, I have a vlog, <laughs> so this is gonna go on the vlog. No, I don't want to be on the vlog. No, it's fine. <laughs> Tell me about this Tokyo hands thing. <laughs> no, I'm too self conscious. Oh, okay, bunny. <laughs> now talk about Tokyo hands. Okay, um, Tokyo hands is like a department type store of hardware and the interior section has fan decks for colorways and just stuff to nerd out on just like colors of France and colors of every little like corner of the world and the interior I don't understand what it is it's like Do a textile ever, like, store it's like a mood you're fabric or something it. you're gonna love it yeah just go okay just go you're gonna freak out there's six different floors with Oh, you Everything know what? I have been to it, and there's like pens and stationery. I've yep. totally been there. Yep, and fan decks are like, you know, when you go yep. to the. No, that's spot. That shot's cool. Yeah, like a Pantone thing. Yeah, exactly. Like a Pantone book. Exactly. Yeah. But it's like. Is it cleaning up your pee? It's everything, so it's cool. Yeah, I've been yeah. to that shop. I love that one. I like all the Japanese stationery stores. You can get really so. cool pens and fucking sticker, double sided stickers. Like, why do we have post it stickers that only have. A sticker on one side, you know, like you double sided sticker. Like it'll be a sticker on one side and you flip it over and there's a sticker on the other side. Oh, like, why didn't we think of that? That's, that's ridiculous. Epic. Why waste <laughs> anyways. That's awesome. Bonnie, so this is your spot now. This is her spot. She peed there. You're good. Well, you're lucky you're so cute. Sorry, your oh. intern. Yeah, he's cool, he doesn't care. He doesn't give a shit. How old are you, Bunny? Almost four months. You're so big. You're such a big dog. Yeah. Man, your teeth are sharp. Watch out. Get him, Bonnie. <laughs> Get him, attack. <laughs> oh, you're so big. Oh, you're so cute, Bunny. Where'd you get her? Uh, locally from a breeder. Locally? Lovely. You're a local dog? Semi-local. You're an L.A. dog? She's high that desert dog. Valley girl? No, she's high desert. What is that called? Like, you know, Angelis Crest? Just beyond there. You like a little Joshua Tree hipster chick? Yeah, pretty much. But cooler. Like a Pinterest dog? <laughs> <laughs> You into Navajo shit? She's totally pink. <laughs> oh, you're so cute, Bonnie. How long you had her? Um, six weeks. I wanted to get one, but I always stress out about like having to take care of the thing, and like it would have to live here in the shop, you know, because I'm here every day. There, I think it'd be a, it'd be great. Like there, she's on. She just would want to be on your lap. That's the only problem. Mm hmm like, That dog. He or she, I just assume. Yeah, yeah. I would make like a door right here and I would just lock him in my office. Hey, Bonnie Barker. Bonnie Barker. You're so cute, Bonnie. All right, well, I'll oh, see you guys oh. soon, Claire. Okay. All right, y'all. I'm going to edit this vlog up. It's only like four o'clock. But I'm going to start getting ready to go. Ugh, to my trip to Japan, Tokyo, and like I said, I think I'm going to vlog separately <sighs> the trip getting there and my edible adventure. It should be pretty funny, so <sighs> we'll see if it turns into its own vlog or, <coughs> <coughs> excuse me, or if I um just end up using that as like the intro to me getting into Japan so we'll see I'm gonna start vlogging again in a couple hours so I wanted to finish this one up get this up and then like I said I'm only gonna have pocket Wi-Fi in uh, in Tokyo so I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be able to upload vlogs 
or anything, but I will have uh, cell service. So I'm going to be able to um, update my Instagram story and all that shit. And at very least post the photos. I'm going to try to upload the vlogs. I'm going to try the first night after I make the first one. Maybe I'll make them shorter or something. I'm not sure what I'm going to do so that they go up easier. But uh, I'm going to still vlog when I'm there, obviously, in Tokyo. I'm just not really sure the whole process yet. But bringing the laptop, bringing the iPad, bringing the Nintendo Switch. Got the crazy edible, so I'm going to get high as fuck. Once I'm there, I'm not sure what the plan is. We'll probably get some weed. I got some backwoods. But I'm not breaking nothing. It's not worth it to deal with that kind of shit. It's not the move. Maybe if we're going somewhere else, a lot less sketch, but... <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for the support. I appreciate you guys. I look forward to seeing the videos too. Japan, be out of the back of my car. Smoking joints only goes so far. You guys are shit. Thanks for the support. I'll see you guys later. Peace. <laughs>